Hello and welcome to another indie horror game. This time I'll be playing a game called Cage Face, and if you want to download it for yourselves, you can for free if you follow the link down below in the description. Now, in Cage Face, I'm going to be playing as an investigator, looking over some cold case documents, we've got a few down here, all regarding rumours and sightings of a mysterious gentleman who looks a little bit like this. Yeah. Interesting design. Don't really know what happened to the top half of his head, but... Hmm. Maybe we'll find out as we have a look at all these documents. I think we're meant to end it with this VHS tape, and that's where the majority of the game actually begins, but let's see. Sorry, couldn't wait. I'll lay some glow sticks, find me. P.S. Record everything. Okay. There's also something from a medical examiner. Multiple stab wounds to the body. The possible weapon used for such wounds could be a pickaxe. Three in the torso there. Right. Yeah, stab wound through the heart. Hmm. Manner of death? Homicide? Yeah, I'd, I'd say so. I'd say so. Uh, looks like we've got some sort of like Polaroid picture of Cage Face. Uh-huh. So it's like he's got a, a light. And I think possibly a canary in that cage. It's like a... well, I guess it's like a canary in a coal mine kind of bird cage. I think that's the idea. Interesting. Yeah, very interesting. Okay, that's a lot of reading. Okay, well, let's begin with May 26th, 1987. Most of these historical sites are to be treated with a bit more dignity, according to my uncle. Yet this evening he decides it's alright to have a little drinking party around this old mine that was uncovered recently. All day he had been assisting the locals in opening up this entrance, working their way through a wall of spiky rocks, and there's still quite some debris left. It's pretty charming seeing him unwind like this after a hard day's work. Okay, I might have to help him resist the urge to have another bottle. I'm sure his work is far from finished and he still has a bunch to do tomorrow. It's been a cool evening, and people have been returning home by now. I had to come back to the site when I realised I forgot this diary. Good thing Phil reminded me of it when I brought him to his apartment. Man, dignity my ass. Look at all the bottles they've left around. Around, I guess. A quick note to self. Ask Jeremy tomorrow if anyone entered the mine earlier uh, this day. That sounds kind of strange. Why, why, why would you say this day instead of today? But anyway, uh, just spotted a wandering light in the distance when I peered through a small opening between the remaining rocks. Did someone manage to get in and trigger a second collapse of the opening? I'm not trying to try and push the rocks aside just by myself. Is that a bird I hear? Hmm. I've been sitting here for a while, just listening to the bird. Don't know, but it sounds so sad. God, it makes me feel a bit empty if that's the right word. Sweet Jesus, that sound did not fit its shape. If that's what it was. I don't know what it was. That one light was shining too bright into my face to see anything. I could see the shape of a man. Christ, thank goodness the entrance was still blocked. Alright, the next day... It's hard to remember all that happened in that split second. My brain was trying to save my skin. I remember the bird from before, but no other sound. I'm sure there was something else. I've tried to share what I observed there, but hell if I'd know how to start. Are you sure it's not dangerous in there? Was all I could say to my uncle. What if something's in there? I continued. He told me he'd be delighted if he found anything. Perhaps traces of history and artifacts that could tell us more. I had less trouble describing the situation to my friends, but their response was harder to process. They told me I just should have gone to sleep as they did and not let the drink get to my head. Well, I wasn't the one vomiting yesterday. I'm not sure what I saw, but that shape and the bright light sure linger as an afterimage in my mind. Good news. My mate Phil, despite not entirely convinced of my story, is very interested in a journey into the mine. He just so happens to have a video camera. We'll be awaiting the removal of all the rocks at the entrance. Once that's done, We'll sneak in and see what we can find. Well, Phil, rest in peace. I'm so sorry. <laughs> All right. Oh, I see the possession experiment over there. Nice one, Alex. Nice one. <laughs> okay, some uh, newspaper excerpts. It looks like two bodies found in a subway tunnel. Horror at a tunnel under construction. And a mine shut down due to deadly gas. Wait, so that one's in Czechoslovakia. That one's in Bristol. A tunnel within a Milwaukee subway. Is Cage Face just in every single tunnel ever? <laughs> Potentially. Potentially. Okay. Well, I think all that's left to do is pick this up. June 13th, 1987. Presumably this is what Phil recorded. Let's have a look. Okay. And here we are. Oh, I, this is actually quite cool. You can still see the outline of the television and yeah, all right. And there's one of the bottles, the aforementioned bottles. 
All right, so yeah, let's go in, shall we? So uh, yeah, there's sprinting, there's no jumping, there is crouching though. I can't believe he talked me into doing this. <laughs> If only you knew how bad it was going to get. Man, you're a horror game protagonist. You're in for a rough ride. Alright, well there's some of the glow sticks I see. I'm curious. Let's go this way. Let's go into the darkest parts of the mine, shall we? Hmm, okay, well. There's a glow stick down here as well, so... this. Old minecarts? Alright. I don't suppose I can actually pick up a glow stick, can I? No. Okay. An old lantern. Alright. Hmm. These will be some of the rocks that they want to remove, I guess. Yeah, this really doesn't seem like a good idea. Why am I on my own? Hmm. Okay, we've got a bit of a blockage. Uh, we've got a bag, actually. Maybe there's something in it? Who would leave their backpack behind in here? Some... Someone who had no more use for it. What the hell is that? Oh, hang on! Oh, there's a zoom! Okay, left click is actually zoom! Wait, was that... Was that him? Was that cage face? Huh, alright. A little bit creepy. Let's keep on going. Okay, yep. Come on, Phil. Get in, get out. Shake it all about. As fast as you possibly can. Ignore that. And, and certainly ignore the bloodstains on the floor as well, yeah. Oh boy. Hmm. I think that's probably where I saw him. Somewhere in there. Okay. Hmm. Right or left? I'm gonna choose right. <laughs> because left is actually blocked. Anything there? No, it doesn't look like it. Alright, this way. This is uh, it's a pretty deep mine. Oh, hang on. Wait, is is that? Is this the guy that was? Oh dear. Oh, he's got a camera. Oh, oh that's where the photo came from. I'm getting the hell out of here. Good idea. Really good idea. Okay, so yeah, let's avoid any pickaxes to the chest, shall we? So there's nothing else to find. Can I actually grab that photo or something? No. Hmm. I suppose I'm going to escape, right? Because, you know, the investigator's got this footage. And I think he's got that photo as well, so the body's going to be recovered. Huh, okay, well, I, you know, it's a fairly linear mine. If I just need to get out the way I came, that shouldn't be too difficult. Yeah. Weird sounds. I don't think it's just the rocks moving or debris falling it's or anything terrible. like that. It's hard to breathe. Mm. Just another reason that you need to get the fuck out. Whoa! Whoa, okay, right, well, there you go. That's Cage Face, literally just spawning in front of me, apparently. Okay, right, well, I, I can see a sort of headlamp. Okay, well, I, I think he's got a pickaxe in hand, so let's try and avoid that. Let's go this way. Okay, yeah, he, he's still coming. Uh, I don't know if he's actually seen me as such. Hmm. If he has, then he just doesn't feel like running. Maybe he's a little bit stiff, you know? Right. Okay, he's still behind me. Well, I mean, if that's that, then... That's fairly easy, right? Unless, of course, he's... 
block the entrance somehow. I don't know. Hmm, okay, this way. Although I suppose if he, if he spawned in front of me and he can go to all these places, he can do that once again. There you go, yeah. Right. Okay, okay. Uh, well, this worked last time, so let's see if it's going to work again. I'm just going to walk around the other side of the minecarts and deal with you that way. Yeah, yeah it's, it's a neat design, honestly. Yeah, I quite like it. He must have seen me by now. I mean, he knows where I am, right? I don't hear a bird like the others did. I'm hearing myself struggling to breathe. I assume that's what that is. This way. It was just straight along the tracks, wasn't it? If I see bottles, I know I'm going in the right direction. That's it. That's that's the exit. Okay, well, he's, he's coming, but, you know. I've got to escape. I have to. Don't you do it. Don't you dare spawn him right in front of me now. Uh, that's it? So he escaped. That's how I got the VHS tape, presumably. Right. Okay. Um. Good stuff. Oh. Oh, the phone. Okay. Hey. Oh. You're calling right on time. Just as I finish watching the tape. Huh. No wonder the guy turned out the way he is now. Perhaps I can interview him. Anyway, looks like I have enough material for my new story. It might even have a name. Cage face. Okay, um, a little bit shorter than I was expecting. Um, and a little bit underwhelming, if I'm completely honest. Yeah, uh, I like the setup, I like the beginning story, I like the background lore and everything, and I liked, it, you know, examining all the documents, putting in the VHS tape. I actually liked viewing the VHS tape as the investigator looking at the TV. That was a that was a nice little um, nice little way of doing it. Um, but as far as the footage of Phil going into the mine, nothing really happened. He just got to the end of the mine, saw a dead body, decided to leave, and Cage Face didn't really provide too much of a threat, honestly. Maybe I got lucky. Maybe he does run after you. Maybe he does swing his pickaxe at you. Maybe there are creepier things that could have happened, but didn't. But yeah, it just, I don't know. It was just uh, a little bit sort of hollow and underwhelming after that build up at the beginning. Come on. Come out, come out. Wherever you are, there he is. Go on then, cage face. Give me your best shot. Give me another ending. What if I don't escape? Okay. That's the end of the footage, apparently. Am I going to get another phone call? I expect so, right? Here we are. Hey, you're calling right on time, just as I finish watching the tape. He was murdered right there while recording. Some real intense stuff. Anyway, looks like I have enough material for my new story. It might even have a name. So there you have it, the other ending to Cage Face. Now I assume there's no ending C, I think it's just you survive or you don't. So, thank you very much for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. Leave your thoughts down below in the comments, maybe like the video if you enjoyed this. What did you guys think of it? I thought this has great potential. I think it's creepy, it's eerie, I like the opening, I like the idea of looking at the VHS tape on the screen, that was nice. The Reading the documents, the opening, the backstory, the lore, the character design, it's great. However, when you get to the VHS tape, that was the mediocre bit, that was the lackluster bit. There wasn't a great deal to do, Cage Face didn't really pose much of a threat, and honestly he felt underutilized. And that's a bit of a shame. But there you go. Thank you very much for watching, see you next time. Yeah, very interesting. Okay, that's a lot of reading. We'll sneak in and see what we can find. Well, Phil, rest in peace. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, I see the possession experiment over there. Nice one, Alex. Nice one. Yeah, this really doesn't seem like a good idea. 
Why am I on my own? Hmm. Who would leave their backpack behind in here? Some... Right or left? I'm gonna choose right. <laughs> because left is actually blocked. Whoa! Well, okay, right, well, there you go. That's Cage Face, literally just spawning in front of me, apparently. If he spawned in front of me and he can go to all these places, he can do that once again. There you go, yeah. Hey. Oh. You're calling right on time, just as I finish watching the tape.